Hi guys, it's Daz here from Review, and as promised, uh, I've been spending a little bit of time with Tasker, and I'm back with an intermediate Tasker review slash guide. And so, um, before we continue, you're going to need a plugin this time for Tasker, and it's called Secure Settings. And so, what we're going to hopefully achieve today um, is we're going to uh, set Tasker up so that when you leave your house, uh, your phone goes through uh, a number of changes. It's going to add a pin code when you're away from your home. It's going to change all your volume settings and it's also going to notify you on your Android Wear device, of course. Um, and I'll show you how to set all of that up and I'll also show you a little bit more advanced uh, Tasker and I'm going to look at nested tasks. And so in Tasker, as we know, we've got the concept of tasks. Um, now sometimes you're going to want to use a task or a number of tasks um, for multiple profiles or for multiple tasks. And, and so what you can actually do is create kind of a, a group of tasks that can then be nested within another. It'll make sense in a mo. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to call this first one um, Home Audio. And the idea here is this will be uh, all my audio settings uh, for home. So the ringtone is fine, but what we're also going to do is change uh, all the volumes and I'll whiz the video um, so you'll see that all of these will be low and so as you can see we've got uh, the ring ringtone set and all of these uh, volumes low except for media because we may actually need to be able to listen to things on the phone while we're at home and so along with home audio we're going to kind of create the reverse of that which will be uh, away audio and uh, in here we're going to set all of the uh, the kind of the opposite of the task that we did a moment ago and again I'll, I'll um, go through this and I'll, I'll whiz it on so that you haven't got to watch me set all this up and so as you can see we've got all of those set here um, the differences are all a lot louder so if we now back up we can review those home and away loud and quiet and so now we can call them from any any task or any profile now as I mentioned, uh, this, is, this, this set of tasks is going to launch um, when we leave our home. Now there's lots of ways of doing this, but we're going to use a state change on this. It's going to be based on the Wi-Fi. Now for the purpose of this demo, I'm going to do it on um, Wi-Fi connected, uh, just because I can then switch my Wi-Fi on and off to, to, to prompt these things. However, um, in real life, I use Wi-Fi near. The reason for that is that Wi-Fi does obviously cut out and uh, get reactivated depending on whether the phone's in sleep mode or not when the screen's off uh, to save power and so that'll, that'll mess with your sound. So I use Wi-Fi near but for now we're going to use Wi-Fi connected. And here we're going to select our, um, our, our Wi-Fi here. So that's all I need to do. And so you'll see now it says Wi-Fi connected, uh, new task. So Wi-Fi connected is going to be when we're at home and we can actually start now already um, using uh, our, our embedded task. But first of all I've got to give it a name. And so um, I'm going to say this one is home. Uh, and if I now go into task, I can say perform task. And in here, I can straight away add home audio. And that's all I need to do right now. Now we've set one thing up here. Um, so when Wi Fi is connected, it will launch home audio. What we can also do uh, is set the exit task. And the exit task here is going to be a new task. We're going to call it away, and then again we're going to add um, another task, uh, away audio. And so that's the most complicated bit that you're going to see on this uh, demo. And so when Wi-Fi is connected, home audio. When Wi-Fi is not connected, away audio. So now uh, what we're going to want to do is uh, elaborate on these. We're going to add some security into here as well. And so if I go to home, um, I'm going to add uh, and use the plugin I mentioned earlier. And so while at home, I'm going to go to secure settings. I'm going to configuration and then dev admin actions and here you can see we've got password and pin. I need to leave the device admin enabled, it gives this some control. But for home I'm going to have uh, pin disabled and that's all I need to do here. So we've got the home uh, security, so now we're going to need to do the, the opposite of that. And so again, plug in, secure settings and uh, within here we will go dev admin, password pin, we're going to enable that, change the pin code and it's going to go one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And so it's uh, super easy to test. As you can see, there's no Wi Fi connection here. And upon turning my uh, phone on, um, it's asking me for a pin code, which I have to enter in. That lets us in. Now, if I was to turn Wi Fi on, we should now run the task of task. If I turn my screen off, start it. 
give Tasker just a chance just to kick in. You'll see it um, removes that pin code entirely. Okay, so now we've got our security and our audio state changes. Uh, let's consider uh, notifications, as I said I would. And we're going to do this in two ways. So we're going to have a notification that shows up on your Android Wear watch. And we're going to have a notification um, that also uh, speaks from the phone. And obviously gives a, a notification within the phone itself. So we're going to need two of these. So let's do the home one first. So go into home. Add a new task. And we're going to do the uh, watch notification first. This is very simple. You go into alert. And the one you're looking for in here is notify vibrate. And I'll give you a card that also vibrates the, uh, the, the watching wrist. So the title is the bit that goes across the top, so welcome home and text. We can put anything we like in here, including variables. And so text we can have um, uh, watch now, actually phone now insecure because we've removed the password. Um, audio low battery of phone and here we're going to just add in the battery level and just to make sure that it looks right we'll put the percentage sign in there as well um, and that's all we actually need to do here um, and I'll create a notification for us and then we're going to do exactly the same um, but in reverse over here so again we're going to want another alert notify vibrate um, leaving home um, we're going to write phone, uh, now secure, um, and again, battery, and we're going to put the percentage in there. And of course you can write whatever you like here. And so we've got now for um, when we're leaving away, away audio, we we'll set the pin, and we've got the notification. And of course we can test these anytime using the little play button down here in Tasker. So here's our away one, perfect, have a nice little note, and uh, we'll try the same for our home. So we can test this properly, um, and so I'll just make sure there's no cards. I'm going to hit Wi-Fi on, it's going to fire up, there's our card. Now if I turn Wi-Fi off, here's our other card. I also promised you audio, um, we had audio before um, on the previous sort of challenge, um, but in case you missed that one, it's very very simple, go to alert and say, you can have the text say whatever you like, so welcome home, lock is off, lock away, I can have it say whatever I like, again, uh, be safe, uh, Daz, phone is locked. And so let's just test these ones. Welcome home, lock is off. Perfect. And away. Be safe, Daz, phone is locked. And so there you go, we've uh, set up a whole state change. It's all aut automated, all works nicely with Android Wear, gives us nice notifications, it's cards. Also the phone's playing its part, we're changing all the volume, the security, and we're also uh, able to uh, make the phone actually talk to us just so that we know what's going on. I've been using this for about a week in a very similar guise, like I said earlier. I use Wi-Fi near and not Wi-Fi connected because it's slightly more um, useful because it's not constantly just dis disconnected when the screen goes off, but really handy. I haven't had to enter a pin code in at home for a long time, um, and it's really handy not to have to play around with the volume settings. And so I consider that a intermediate level sort of tasker. Um, join me soon and we'll be going through something a little bit more complex. We'll be sending variables to the watch and we'll also be setting up some scenes um, and scenes are basically displays on the phone that then allow you to make decisions um, and that'll be coming next. So thanks for joining me again guys. Um, as you can probably hear I'm a little bit croaky, I've been a little bit ill this week, hence no videos, but I'll be back on top of it soon. Hopefully also we'll have Android uh, Wear 5.0 to discuss and look forward to a, a video that explores all those features too. Thanks for your support guys, we're up to about 380 subscribers now so it's going well. Cheers, bye bye.